We are so excited for our season four finale. This season you have seen our biggest pool to date and best friend neighbors. We are at Michael Sorby's pool. This award-winning luxury custom pool. The award we have been after for many years. Just wait till you see this custom luxury pool. Every week, the experts at Superior Pools of Southwest Florida share the latest trends in outdoor living spaces, including custom designs, ideas, and innovations. Watch this inspiration and transformation come to life thanks to our expert opinions and tips, and improve your own outdoor paradise. This is Home Sweet Home, presented by Superior Pools. I'm Michael Sorby. I'm a design consultant uh, here at Superior Pools. Growing up in the family, everybody golfed, and I made that my career. I worked for two different golf manufacturers, and most of the times I was on the PGA Tour. And so I did that for about 10 years, traveled you know, anywhere between 70, 75% or more of the year, and every city was new and exciting. But you know, after 10 years of doing it, it, it got uh, tiresome. I decided to take uh, about a year sabbatical. In that time frame, my wife and I decided to move and build a new home and we were presented with only one option with that builder in terms of what the pool was and uh, certainly was not a fan for a lot of different reasons. And so I took my design background in terms of what I did in my past career and kind of brought it to, you know, designing my pool personally for ourselves. And that's how I came, long story short, to, to be with Superior. Uh, we're at my wife's and I's personal home this evening uh, to talk about our new pool, which, which actually is the, uh, the third pool uh, that I built with Superior, the first one actually as a client and then two since uh, after uh, coming to work for them. And uh, looking forward to uh, telling you all about the, uh, the different features and, and uh, the, the thought process of uh, why we created what, what you see behind me here. I'm a very clean line, linear type yeah. person. And I say me, you know, it's my wife and I, because when it comes to the pools, well, I do this for a living. <laughs> your world. She lets me uh, just uh, kind of take over, which is kind of the only time that happens. Right. So yeah, everything here is just very geometric, you know, whether it's the pattern in the deck, this kind of floating decoration here to kind of fill in the gap between the two uh, kind of bay window areas of the home, mm -hmm. uh, the floating steps, you know, basically the only thing round here would be the bar stools. So the one feature, if I had to pick one feature though, it would be the bar stools for two reasons. Obviously they're very cool, they're that Easter egg. You know, when you first approach the pool, even where we're sitting here, you can't see them. And so it's maybe that last thing, you're like, hey, how, that's pretty cool, you got built-in bar stools. And then with this nice lanai space, this covered space, and almost everybody these days seems to have that outdoor television, you, you get to functionally use them as well. Certainly I like raised areas. Yeah. This deck over here is, you know, just a foot above this deck that we're standing on. But when you sit up there, you feel like you're four or five feet in the air. Playing with different elevations is also a really fun part to add to our outdoor living space. So raising this just a foot adds so much space to this and also allows for you to have this nice luxurious sunning space. And this isn't a very large space either, but it's just enough for sunning. Stay tuned for more Home Sweet Home presented by Superior Pools. Questions about pool financing? Lion Financial can help. Unlike banks, we specialize in swimming pool financing solutions. Can you help my parents get a pool? How about a patio? Do fish have islands? Allowing us fast? to provide personalized and affordable financing options to make all your backyard dreams come true. Do you like dogs? With over 400,000 satisfied customers nationwide, why choose anyone else? Lion Financial. Your dog-loving swimming pool financing specialist since 1979. This idea here, you know, with the spa and the floating steps basically came from this, especially in our location, very popular this year for people to request or the idea anyways of a flush spa yeah. where you kind of hide it in the pool. And I think I took that to the next level with the floating steps there because at first glance, it just looks like it's part of the pool. Wife's favorite feature, I would say the spa, you know, she, she uh, works really long days there at the hospital, especially the last two years uh, with all the COVID cases, among other things, she's in the ICU. Uh, and so, you know, after a long, hard day to be able to uh, turn the spa on, whether I'm home or not from our phone, she'll spend plenty of nights just sitting in there and relaxing. When I first saw pictures of the pool, um, I didn't even realize that was a spa yet. Yeah. I, I looked into it deeper. I'm like, oh, wow, that's a really nice way to hide it in there and, and camouflage it with the rest of your pool here. Yeah, that came from 
a creative process, but kind of also stretching the dollar. So I knew I yeah. was spending money on a lot of other features. Right. Generally, your spa is going to become your main water feature because more times than not, they're raised, the water falls obviously into the pool. And so I came with the flush spa because to make my pool larger would obviously cost more money to make it a certain square footage. Here was a way to kind of accomplish that without spending more money because I was already going to buy a spa. I was already designing the other water features as part of the project. So the flush spa made my pool grow, even though technically, wink, wink, it's not really the pool itself. You know, with the, the raised wall behind it, that was really just, I'd say really from aesthetics standpoint why I did that, but also for privacy from the neighbor. You're in the spa late in the evening. They have no idea that you're in there and you feel like you're in your own kind of world, which is nice. So talking about that wall, because I, I think this is a really cool feature that mm -hmm. you did, and I don't know the intention, but having the raised beam across the back with a, a darker tile and the raised area in the face of this, and then that wall, um, we've never finished a wall like that. Uh, so tell me about it. What, how'd you come up with that and you know, where did it come from? Yeah, I mean, the inspiration I think was the outdoor kitchen that we built. Obviously you have to facade the bottom of your cabinet of your kitchen. And I wanted the kitchen to look like it was all part of the same design, right. built at the same time. And so I knew I was gonna do basically what they call a sand finish on the stucco. Yep. And uh, I was gonna paint it. And then actually my mom had the idea, give her credit that she said, why don't you use a metallic paint? So it still has some sparkle and some luster, some depth to it, especially not this time of day, but you know, when the sun's right on it, it really, really has some depth to the wall. Yeah. And uh, yet yeah, then it ties into the kitchen so it all looks cohesive there. It's the details, those little things that I was able to kind of, I feel like in a sense, perfect or, or, or come up with, you know, obviously the one right in front of us here, kind of this floating deck area with the, the black Mexican pebble, you know, the texture on the one wall with the spa, you know, floating the scupper down from the coping is a little bit different and unique. Having one fire bowl and water bowl is unique in the sense that typically you have two or three or even more and balancing having just one with the way the feature was laid out. So all those little details really kind of what uh, make me really, really proud and happy about what, what we were able to build here. Stay tuned for more Home Sweet Home presented by Superior Pools. Take a break from being poolside. Come on down to the Superior Pools Tomahawk Tiki Bar located at Cool Today Park, Spring Training, home of the Braves. The Tiki Bar is open year round, providing lunch, dinner, drinks, and live entertainment. Superior Pools provides our customers with excellent design, execution, and service on their custom pool. When the job is finished, there's no better place to relax than with friends here at the Tomahawk Tiki Bar. The bar is located directly inside Cool Today Park, located in Northport, Florida. You know, having one one bowl in the center sure. and the scuppers, your raised beam, you balance it out with all the landscaping, it looks beautiful. Yeah, so the, uh, the uh, square scuppers here basically were designed to be in line with the front door. So as soon as you walk in the house, the furniture just happens to be off to the side. The first thing you notice is those scuppers. A lot of times our lanai's, as nice as they are, the patio furniture can kind of block your view of your main feature. And so that was kind of where that came from, offsetting it so that it's not offset from the door or the lanai, but it is technically in terms of the design of the pool. Yeah. Did the same black finish to tie in, you know, the black Mexican pebble, the black glass we put in the bowl. The fire water bowls are a great feature. Again, having natural gas allowed me to take advantage of that. This time, the last two communities I lived in wasn't an option and uh, especially in the evening, just the glow that it makes, you know, across the water is really, really cool, uh, yeah. that effect, let alone the flame itself. These uh, agave are actually not real. Yeah. You know, they look real, spent a lot of time researching them. And <laughs> so they're low maintenance, just wash them, you know, wipe them down every once in a while. These uh, bromeliads, which are called uh, strawberry bromeliads are actually real, but you know, one of the fronds might take six months before it kind of wilts. You got this, picture window all the way on three sides because I have no neighbors to look at. Normally you just do it in the back to enhance your view. But the header beam holding up the lanai from inside the house actually hides that. So when you come in oh, the front door, awesome. you're in the kitchen, you think you have no screen, wow. which we, nobody really wants the screen enclosure, ideally. Yeah. And that's kind of the idea, but you need the protection, yeah. especially late night when especially you're Especially with the preserve like this. Preserve, the you have bugs, the bugs, the yep. you, you need that protection, so. Exterior or outside space is just as important as a pool. We are pool builders, but we're also dream makers and makers of outdoor oasises. So today at Michael's, they've talked enough about the pool and I want to talk a lot about this luxurious space that I'm sitting here in, as you can see. Um, besides the fact of just what we put down on the floor, what we put in the pool, what it's all about 
the ambiance. So we always try to help our clients really get in their heads and say, what are you expecting from your space? Are you wanting to entertain? Are you wanting to have a sitting space? Are you wanting to be able to sit with a big family at a table? Do you want to have maximized sun space? Do you want more shade? There are so many factors that go into building a pool, an outdoor oasis, besides just the pool and what that shape looks like. We have this beautiful wall feature that of course has golf playing for the golf pro. But this wasn't something that he necessarily wanted in his home, it existed. So when this house plan came to life, Michael took it and ran with it and said, I'm gonna make this a wall feature so that I can have my TV, have a nice fire feature, but also accentuate all of my furniture along with it. So it really just all blends in together really well. And then when you peek over on the other side of the wall, there's a little bit something special over here. So we have this really pretty tile accent wall so that we just don't have, again, a very basic wall. And it all ties in with the pool because it's the same tile as the raised area. Every ounce of what you put into your pool, your outdoor space is just as important. Stay tuned for more Home Sweet Home presented by Superior Pools. Enjoying the outdoors is what living in Florida is all about. And at Absolute Aluminum, we're in the business of making your outdoor living dreams a reality. We can transform your space into a stunning retreat with open view cages, adjustable pergolas, outdoor kitchens, and many other products. Everything we do is completely custom maximizing your space to fit your project with our extensive design capabilities. Contact us today or visit our showroom located in Venice, Florida. Michael, uh, when we built this first pool, you actually presented your design to us first, right? Correct, yes, yeah. So I took my design background and applied it to pools and found obviously Superior with all their wonderful reviews and background. And then they took me and educated me from there. It's like now I do with my clients. So I've always been on that side of the table as well, so to speak, that the client sits there. I completely understand it. And even so now, you know, even though I work for Superior, I can speak from, you know, firsthand experience as opposed to just me kind of preaching it to them. You know, basically it's a large puzzle and you're trying to put it together as best as you see fit. And we all have a budget and you gotta stay within, so to speak, that budget, but you really don't want to, a few months afterwards, really regret something. Correct. Given the magnitude of what you are doing. A lot of times when you have a budget, a lot of people, you know, my budget's my budget, I'm not gonna go over. But when you're building a pool, once the deck's going down, you can't replace it. Once the tile's in, you can't replace it. It's there. You have one shot. And it's, it's my kind of duty really to make sure that I tell the client, here's all of your options. Correct. They make the decision that's best for them. I'm not gonna tell them what to do despite my experience. And so hopefully, you know, when the, the pool is built, they got a big smile on their face and we make sure that we everything that they wanted. For years, we've been looking uh, to win this award for luxury pools and we finally did it with this pool. So yeah, that with was, that was your that. pool, your design, <laughs> Your creative mind, our crew, Superior, the whole team. You know, we went from being a spec pool builder back in the days where we used to build for all home builders. Now we're strictly custom luxury. And that's where we want to be. We want to be taking care of the homeowners, custom quality and luxury. And that's, that's what we're achieving, so. If you're interested in having a pool built by Superior Pools, please visit www.superiorpools.com. Home Sweet Home presented by Superior Pools would like to thank our sponsors.